you drool in your sleep? <laughs> everyone drools in their sleep. I don't know about everyone. I feel like I didn't for a long time, and then I do all the lot. time, especially yeah. on the on the pillows on the couch. Oh yeah, well those are terrible pillows, and I yeah. think in my unconscious state, I'm rebelling against how terrible those pillows are. Okay, I think so. Also, it's impossible to get it out. If you ever come over our house and you're sitting on the couch and you uh, there's some black fuzzy pillows and you're like, ooh, these are soft. And I've seen people do it. Guess what? Mike Hashtag strooled. yawn. Mike strolled all over them. Onto and into them, baby. Yeah. <laughs> so much. Then it's all matted down yeah. in the morning or, or at three o'clock in the morning when I wake up. Yeah. You called me out on drooling. This morning. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you get got. Yeah. You know what happens? What? Were you going to say something know, else? I'm listening. Um, what happens, Mike? Tell me what happens. I'll tell you exactly tell what happens. Tell me what happens. <laughs> tell me. No. Uh, sometimes I drool out of my mouth. Okay. And then uh, like early on in the night. Okay. And then I'll shift and my head will go down. Right, right into Slip it. off the pillow. And then my eye is in it. Your spit. Yeah. And I'll wake up and my eye is wet. And I'm like, what the fuck? Wet How sad eye. were my dreams? And then <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm like, oh, I I went in. I dove uh, in. You know first. what I've done before is like woke up in like a pool of like, you know, saliva. Yeah. You know, drool. Mm-hmm. I've turned my pillow over and I go right back to sleep. <laughs> this is the bed's it problem. It happens. Yeah. You know? Do you know why it happens? I don't. I got a couple um, theories. I got a couple theories. Okay. And you tell me which one. All right. Your problem. Okay. Stems from sleep position. Okay. There That's are people fair. who sleep on their sides yes. and on their stomachs, and they are more likely to hashtag yawn with their mouth open. To water from their mouth. <laughs> to water from their mouth. Yes. I, I'm into it. Do you, you're a stomach sleeper. Yeah, but I've had to train myself to stomach sleep, like side sleep on my face with my arms down. As opposed to what? As opposed to me sleeping on my arms. Oh, I thought you were going to say as opposed to just like sleeping face down <laughs> with your <laughs> with your face straight on into the pillow. No air, no, no air. No, yes, air. I have to breathe. I'd be dead. Who sang that song? No air to breathe. No, no, no. No, no air. No air. Air. You can't just Wave start singing and pretend that you're not. Air. <laughs> Dude. Air. <laughs> Zoya does this thing where she'll sound very sure. She'll give you facts about a thing before she knows, she knows anything if it's about the true. Thing. That's not true. That's not always true. But it is sometimes true. But I and love I think that's when, when I am 100% right and you still don't believe me. Because of all the other times. <laughs> and I'm like, see, fool, don't. Don't tell me. You're way more right than you're not right. What can I say? I'm pretty fucking That's awesome. why it pisses me off when you're like, oh, yeah, definitely this. And yeah. I'm like, you sure? I'm like, nah, I've never heard of that thing. <laughs> 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 but that doesn't happen half as much as the times when you're right. And yeah. I'll be the first one to tell you. Yeah. No air, yeah. no air. No, that's yeah. not how it goes. And it may No. Uh-huh. No. Okay, what is your other thing? Uh, blocked sinuses. You yes. Got blocked sinus, girl. Thousand percent. You got boogies in your shiz. Always. You got a schnoz full of bugs. Got a schnoz all day boogers. Are you dealing with some kind of sinus situation? Are the plants changing around you as we speak? The emoji with the woman like this. Are you running hot bugs down your face? <laughs> you might have a sinus thing. You've been sneezing a lot and not having any of the other symptoms of a cold, and it's annoying the shit out of me. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks a lot. You know what I mean? It's yes. like have a cold. It's like you're always in an attic looking for <laughs> a cold. A cold. Yeah. And you found it. Yeah. 
or you started to. Yeah. I feel like I've been on the verge of getting sick and I've been trying to, I've just been keeping it at bay and just like a sneeze here and there. The girls at work were like, you're sneezing a lot. Are you sick? Are you sick? Are mm-hmm. you sick? I'm like, no, I'm not sick. I'm just sneezing McGee over here. I don't, I'm not sick. But I'm just a little have... achy. I'm sneezing. I yeah. got a runny nose and temperature and a fever. But I don't, <laughs> I don't have like, you know, leaky nose or, you know. Yeah. You're not like blowing eyes. your nose. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you know are you how do you keep the sickness at bay michael bay i don't know i think i get enough sleep at night oh humble brag uh which pisses you off all the time why because you want to hang out and well you go to you're going to sleep earlier and earlier because i'm an old lady man i'm but tired i don't have any goddamn friends <laughs> So you got to yeah, hang but out like, with We're up today. We were up 10 minutes before six today. You see this? Yes. You know what this means? We're forever and ever and ever. So even if I'm asleep, it doesn't mean that I'm leaving you. This means you have to hang out with me. Mike. Literally, he's like, why are you leaving me? And I'm like, I'm going to sleep. Yeah. I'm not leaving you. You don't know that. I do. Know you could that. find somebody better in your dreams. That's where dream guys are from. That's where the man of your dreams lives. Trust me, if <laughs> the man of sleep. my dreams came to real life, you would know. I do know because I have a mirror. <laughs> <laughs> GERD, you could also have GERD. What's GERD? GERD is where your stomach's all fucked up and your shit from your stomach flows back out your mail. And that could be a reason why you're drooling in your sleep. That's like acid reflux. Yeah. Ugh. You could have that. And I've then you having, have to wear special shoes. I've been having a lot of heartburn light lately. Why is that? I don't know. I hate it, though. Tums has become my best friend. Tums, 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 Tums. Dude, that antacid. Need it. I think it's antacid. Could be a medication side effect. Are you on any medication? No. I should be, though. Or you could have sleep app. I don't, I don't think I have sleep apnea. I. So last week, okay, I was asleep and Mike, apparently I, what Mike thought I was crying really hard in my sleep, but I was laughing really hard in my dream. Can't tell you what it was. Don't remember. Yeah. Don't remember. But you I rem- told me what it was, but I, it wasn't funny. It was but not funny. But it made you funny. crack up. It, but it, I literally was cracking up. I was having like a string of like nightmares too. And I, it was like, I woke up feeling weird that I was laughing about <laughs> it, but then was kept laughing because I was laughing so hard in my dream. Uh-huh. Right? Yeah. So. I did think it was funny that you were laughing so hard at something that wasn't funny. And I was like, oh, that must have been a real like childhood sense of joy going oh, on. Oh, totally. Totally. Um. But all I heard was <laughs> like a dog. <laughs> so I was like, she's crying. Need to save her. Hey, wake up, babe. Babe, wake up. Baby, my best friend, wake up. Yeah. I remember because <laughs> you were like, are you crying? And I'm like, no, I'm laughing. And then I was like, I kept laughing and I went right back to sleep. Yeah. And then there was no more laughing. I felt like I ruined it. I ruined felt like it. everyone was having a nice time and doing an inside joke. And then I came into the circle and I was like, explain what we're laughing about. (laughs) And then it stopped. But I was having really fucked up dreams, though, last week. Hmm. I wonder why. You're laughing at the pain. Maybe. Psychopath. Maybe. Well, I won't mess with you. And how could we avoid what? My ears are bothering me. What's wrong? Well, maybe they're filled with fluid from this cold that you've been having for three years. (laughs) Because that happens when you have a head cold. It's all in the notes. Okay. Let me check your chart. Yeah, okay. <laughs> so, you know, one of the things, this is interesting. One of the things you could do to drool less is drink more water. Why do you think that's... Maybe because you get the motion of swallowing. Because when you're drooling, you're not swallowing your saliva. So, like, if you didn't swallow all day long your saliva, you would drool it right out of that mave. Do you swallow in your sleep, your mate? I would, I would assume so. Anytime anybody's like, <laughs> <laughs> you know, <laughs> that's very accurate, right? right? Yeah, yeah, I guess. I always, uh, 
I don't know. I always wake up like, like just dry. Dry as fuck. Mouth, not like. Why is it that you, when you drink a lot of water, you wake up dry, but if you don't drink as much water, you drool at your meat? Dude, I didn't <laughs> I know, know your foot was there, <laughs> and I got real scared about it. It's my foot. Oh, boy. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. What was it? The the glove? Glove? What was it? What? Geronimo? What was the... What are you talking the about? Stomach? GERD? GERD. GERD? You could have GERD. Ugh. Um, Derek Von weird. Gerd, Darren Von Gerd, excuse me. Um, you could also, uh, what the fuck? Oh, you could wear a CPAP machine, which just blows air could back you, into your mouth. Could you drool inside of that? I wonder. I'm sure you could, but it'll probably dry up and Before. it'll probably. Uh, but is it like a constant flow of air? Yeah, or? small, okay. gentle, constant flow of air. Okay. Which, you know what? I don't even need that humble brag, not sponsor, but I do want to use it because when I was silver lining in the hospital, uh-huh. whenever I had the, do you ever have the fucking, the, the thing, the, the little air? tube? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not intubated, the but they the oxidril. oxidril, I think oxidril. it's called. It's a new drug. Oxidril. <laughs> and they blow that oxidril into your nays. Um, when they just put it, just a lee yeah, up yeah, in yeah. your nose. Yeah. That's nice. Is it? Is you that a, constant air or is it like Yeah, yeah, it air? goes like this. Uh, I've never had one. Why did you say yes when I said, do you ever have this? No, I, I said, I no, I didn't mean to say yes, but I knew what you were talking about. Yes, I know what you're talking about. Seriously? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Rude. Um, fuck. I'm on the wrong thing. So you could have a CPAP machine. Mm-hmm. You could have Botox surgery. It Botox? says. Botox? And I don't know how to that would fix it. To stop from drooling? Yes. But I don't know where you would put it. In, yeah. I mean, I've heard of getting Botox in your armpits. And it stops you from drooling. And it stops you from sweating. It stops from people that perspirate too much. <laughs> Why did you sound like a fucking coal miner when you said that? <laughs> when you I'm going up and then God darn mountains and we're going to get into those mines. You don't want to perspirate while you're up there. We'll kill a canary while we perspirate. <laughs> Or you can get what they call a mandibular device. Mandibular? Yeah, and I think it's something that like looks like headgear, but it like moves your jaw oh, yeah, in a certain way sense. where you don't drool out your mouth. They probably inject your jaw too, because they do that for like lo- lo- uh, Loch Ness monster. Yes, Nelly. That's yes, yes. Uh That's where the Botox is? Yeah, I think so. Hmm. I think they can I think I'll stay natural, thanks. What do you think? Don't hate on it. I think I'll stay natural, thanks. Don't hate on it. I need... I think I want some again. Where? I did it in my forehead. Where and why? My forehead. What's wrong with your forehead? It's wrinkly. Everyone's forehead is wrinkly. That's how you know you've been thinking... I've years. been thinking. How would you even know that someone's thinking if they didn't have wrinkles in their forehead? That's why everybody looks dumb as shit. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> you can't make decisions without a goddamn wrinkle in your forehead. Um, <laughs> What is this? Dude, I wrote this so small that I don't know what it is. I'm While sorry. I'm trying to figure out what this says, I'm going to ask you if you've ever drooled in bed with a, a stranger. I've never been in bed with a stranger. That's good. That's a good Christian answer. That's a Hans Christian answer, sin. Thank you. Hans Christian answer, sin is, <laughs> and I don't want to overstate this, the funniest thing I've ever said in my entire <laughs> life. Um, Not to be outdone by edibles taste like somebody drops snacks on a dispensary floor. (laughs) That's good. I'm having a good day, man. Give it up top, baby. I'll tell you this right now. I haven't (laughs) smoked today and I'm feeling pretty pretty clear headed. Pretty good.